Hey everyone, so today I am back with a review um, of the 24 hour one day tattoo real lasting eyeliner by K Palette. Um, this is a Japanese brand eyeliner and it is supposed to be the number one selling um, eyeliner in Japan. Um, I am in Asia right now and I got this for about 20 Singapore dollars in Watson's. Um, I am sure you can purchase it online. Um, I'm sure it's available, you know, in Watson's across Asia. Um, I have heard absolutely amazing things about this. However, it is about $20, like I said. It is pretty pricey for a drugstore, mess, uh, drugstore eyeliner. However, makeup in Asia is pretty expensive. Um, for example, Maybelline and L'Oreal go for about triple the price. Um, mascara that would cost about 7 to $10 at Walmart would cost about $25 here. So it is about triple the price, um, and even Asian made stuff is still pretty pricey. So I did decide to go ahead and purchase it anyway because I have heard such great things about it. Um, just um, if you guys are looking to purchase it, please be careful because um, even if you go up in store at the display, there are a lot of different eyeliner brands that look very similar to it, and they even say the whole one day tattoo 24 hour thing. Um, However, they are not the same brand, so be careful and make sure you get the K-Palette brand um, eyeliner. Um, I was kind of confused at the at the um, display, too, because a lot of them look extremely similar. So it is kind of a standard plastic packaging, um, you know. And um, this is a liquid eyeliner, and I got this one in super black. It also comes in, like, regular black, I suppose, and a brown. Um... It is just what it looks like outside the packaging. It says K palette. And then it says real lasting eyeliner on the side. 24 hour waterproof. And um, one day tattoo. This is made in Japan too. As you guys can see, I liked it so much. I went out and I got a second one. Um, so yes, while it is expensive, it does work extremely, extremely well. Um, so it is in pen form. For an eyeliner it's a liquid eyeliner and it's in pen form um it has a felt tip like this it reminds me of the one of my old revlon eyeliners that also had a similar tip and the dolly wink eyeliner has a similar tip um as you guys can see i did already draw some lines it can draw a super thin line and a thicker line i shall show you guys so a thinner line and a thicker line um, it is extremely dark too. It gives you a lot, a lot of control. I definitely, definitely rec recommend it. It dries really fast. Um, for example, I shall rub it right now. If you guys can see that, it didn't move at all. Like, I shall be rubbing it back and forth with a lot of force and it is not budging at all. It is very impressive, I think, that a liquid eyeliner can dry so incredibly fast and stay so incredibly put um so yeah it is not budging so i think that's what's extremely impressive and that's extremely good about this eyeliner is that for a liquid eyeliner it's very very user friendly even if you are a beginner when it comes to liquid eyeliners i don't think you should have a problem using this eyeliner um it is waterproof it doesn't smudge um of course if you go swimming while wearing this eyeliner more likely than not it is gonna rub off however just for like, you know, rain or drizzle or something. Um, you should have no problem. Humidity, you should have a problem. Um, I do like this a lot. I am wearing it today. Um, I did bring it out a lot. Um, not a lot. I bring it out a little bit. Um, I do recommend it. I do like it a lot. Um, I'm sure you can find it online. Um, it's a great eyeliner. If you guys can get your hand on it, I definitely recommend it. Especially if you like, um, liquid liners. Um, it's an extremely extraordinary eyeliner. Um, even though it is a little bit pricey, I do so recommend it. Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy this review. And please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.